Hey guys, it's Zambuk Zero with another video tutorial. Um, today I'm going to show you how to bridge your connection. Now, um, to the normal average user, this is useless, but if you run VMware or um, a few other things, it's hard to mention things, you may need to bridge your connection for uh, a number of reasons. Now, the reason I'm using it is for the next tutorial, we need a wired connection, and all I have is a wireless connection, so I'm going to show you how to kind of fake a wired connection with your wireless connection. So uh, this is specific to Windows 7. It might work on Windows Vista, I'm not sure, and it is completely different from XP. Um, so to get started, down in the bottom right, if you have a wireless connection, you'll see this, these little bars here for your wireless card. Right-click those and hit Open Network and Sharing Center. On the left side, click, click uh, Change Adapter Settings, and here is a list of all of the network adapters in your uh, computer. I have a Bluetooth, the uh, local area connection where the Ethernet cable goes, and my wireless card. So what I want to do is bridge my wireless to my Ethernet so that uh, my wireless internet is fed to the um, quote unquote local area connection, which is not actually going to be doing, it's all virtual. So select the both of them and click bridge connections. And uh, that'll take a good mm, 15 seconds. Okay, here we go. Now, as you can see down here, I am no longer on a uh, connection. So what I'm going to do here is, there we go. It's ad identifying and home to. That is the name of my wireless network. And right here, you can see enabled bridged. So uh, all of my internet is being kind of forwarded to this fake uh, ethernet port. You can see that the, uh, right here, connected to home and uh, home to internet access. Uh, home is my wireless, but I'm not connected to it. I'm connected to home to uh, internet access, which is the bridge connection. So that is how you bridge your connection on Windows 7. Uh, stick around for the next tutorial.